Howdy, everybody! Hey! Yeah, everybody? Yeah, everybody! Welcome to the Jidel Submission subreddit! We're reacting to some Jidel memes. Jidel in any mini hoop challenge. JJ Berea. Jidel in Zach's King of the Court video. <laughs> Superman Dwight Howard! Yeah, I mean, I've lost a lot of weight, guys. I'm able to get up a little bit higher than I used to, and I've always been kind of decent on the mini hoop low key, so I did good. But I'm gonna say this, you know, Zach's next mini hoop video with me in it, I do something extremely dirty. And it's probably going to be the only thing we talk about on the next Jidel Submission subreddit whenever Zach posts that video. So be on the lookout. Be on the lookout for that. Too hype when Mopey misses a shot. Oh dear. Oh dear, gorgeous. Too hype when Jesse misses a shot. You fudging donkey! Well, I mean, you know, that's how it be. You know, you expect that person to miss a shot. Well, actually, you know, I kind of expect Mopey to make it now. I feel like Mopey, the way Mopey works is just like, you think he's going to miss, so he's going to make it. And when you think Mopey's going to make it, you're going to miss it. I don't know. That's how I feel Mopey's game has evolved. Me when Jidel did the James Charles impersonation. Come on, y'all. It's not that hard to do that impersonation. You just say the phrase and try to raise your voice. It wasn't that weird, okay? Chris was Lil Tekka before Lil Tekka became Lil Tekka. Oh, this is the old house. I feel like Chris has like the type of glasses where he can just completely change the way he looks really quick. You know, I could probably do that too. I got some blue light glasses I'm trying to take a nap after this video. So let me just filter out all this blue light. Oh, yeah. You like this fashion? I know you do. Jidel, stop the mopey abuse. Mopey, don't do that. Don't give me hope. <laughs> we need to end mopey abuse. I'd run out of content if we did those, so my official stance, stop the mopey abuse. My under the table, un unofficial stance, keep going. <laughs> the four horsemen of the apocalypse. Joel shirt, Jidel, Reese's shirt, Mopey, Flight by June, Big Shirt, Drodel. You can't have me on here twice. We need to find a fourth horseman. I'm actually really curious to see Flight by June. Does Flight have a court he's able to practice on during the quarantine, or is he just going to be doing at-home handles workouts? If he's only working on his handles, we'll see how his jump shot is, but all right, you know, I'm excited to see June Flight. I think it's going to be a different animal none of us are prepared for, but I also hope June never comes so the meme doesn't die, because if he doesn't end up being decent, the meme will just have to turn around. And we don't want that. Stop making fun of bad crops or draw 25. Look, I'm never gonna stop. This is an abomination of a cutout, but better than most, so we like it. Your crop is elite. There's still a watermark though. There is a watermark. Just crop that out. You don't need to give me a credit. Petition for Jidel to get Mopey a big Dion Waiters jersey. I should get Mopey a Dion Waiters Lakers jersey, even though I did not like that roster move. Y'all know I don't like Dion, but he's Mopey's favorite player other than JaVale, so. Gotta get him the, the Dion jersey. The loudest sounds on earth. Concert speakers. Fireworks. Gunfire. Blue whale. Wait, blue whales are more loud than gunfire and fireworks? I didn't know that. Space shuttles. Yo, what's good guys? It's Jidel! That is one of the loudest sounds on earth. I do have loud intros. I feel like it's just like I'm trying to breathe some energy into my intros, you know? Like I'm not always the most energetic dude. I need to like amp myself up when I get recording. That's like, it's just how it be, you know? Like you gotta get into the motion, you feel me? Getting to play Jidel, realizing he has a big shirt on. Yeah, that's when you know you messed up. If you see me walk up to the court with an oversized t-shirt, just take your basketball shoes off and go home. You know you're not going to beat this, this specimen up here. It's just not happening. I will tell my kids this was James Charles. If the top beauty YouTuber looked like this slash me, that would be a bad sign for the beauty community. <laughs> Big shirt LeBron! Did LeBron steal my swag? LeBron! What the hell, bro? I thought we were, I mean, I didn't think we were friends. You've never met me. You might know about me. I know about you, but I mean, you stole my big, now this isn't, this is still kind of tight, bro. This is kind of tight on him. It may be long, but it's not a big, big shirt. Plus LeBron's normal shirt size is probably like a 2XL, to be honest. Makes fun of James for having no eyebrows or bottom teeth. James with eyebrows and bottom teeth. Oh, that is freaky. Burn it! Burn it, burn it, burn it, and never stop burning. Yes, I agree. Where are his lips? Yeah, you took my lips out. What the f***? There's still time to delete this. I, yeah, I don't like this image. This image freaks me out. Me and the boys in online class. This was a solid edit. Jesse's eyes freak me out. Tyler's got a great beard. He should definitely grow a mustache that's that, you know, wide across his whole face. I would be honored to. This act just kind of got like a light and then we clowned him up. And then Chris, I feel like we smushed it down a little bit. I don't really know. I remember when I saw that for the first time and I was like, Garth's gone too far, but let's keep it. <laughs> Want to hear a joke? Me. What do you call it when Jidel shoots a three? Friend. 
What? Me, Drydell. Hey, come on now, my three-point shot hasn't been that bad in all the videos lately. Explain this to us, Drydell. <laughs> I think I just missed that. Yeah. Again, some people call that an ankle breaker. The reason I don't really call that an ankle breaker, and I'm not saying I've never got my ankles broken, I feel like people think I'm just being really stubborn, is because Mal didn't really do a move. Like, you could say he spun back, but I think my foot probably, yeah, let's, well, let's see, let's see. If, if, if he spins before I, before my foot plants, ankle breaker. If he spins after my foot already f***ed up, not an ankle breaker, in my opinion. I guess ankle breaker. I think, I think my foot is in the wrong position. Or am I going for a steal? I don't know what happened. I guess that's my explanation. I guess it is an ankle, I don't know. I have really bad footwork slash ankles, especially before they've been getting better. Yeah, just a bad misstep, either because I tried to steal it, or because of the spin, or because I just fell. It's one of those three things. It's been a long time since that happened, so I don't know. I think I just misstepped. I misstep a lot. There's a lot of times I just fall on the court. Warriors rings in one picture. 2015, 2017, 2018. Facts, man. I mean, I think they still would have won in 2017, to be honest, but 2018, I think the Rockets would have beat them. 2017, I think they would have figured out how to beat the Spurs. That game won. Everything was going right for the Spurs. I don't know if they would have been able to keep it up. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. No, Kawhi was playing like an absolute monster, but 2015, maybe it's tough. You know, it's, it's not like game one wasn't competitive before Kyrie got hurt and also love was hurt. So, I mean, there's also more than just Kyrie being hurt, but 2018 was really the one where I felt like they would have lost if Chris Paul stayed healthy. Joel B drawing for Jidel. Nice. This is really good. I like this. What was your YouTube? Jesse LM. Hey, shout out to Jesse LM for the drawing, bro. I appreciate that. Of course, you had to draw Joel Embiid as he was silencing my Miami Heat and he kicked us out of the playoffs. But I appreciate the drawing. That's hella dope, bro. I think this is your channel. So, hey, you got the Joel Embiid there. Shout out to you, man. Kind of facts, though. Jidel after the 15 million joke about Mopey crossing him up. <laughs> kind of over that. Moving on. Drodal filming a banger. Peep the room number. Let's check this bad boy out, if you know what I'm saying. Can't wait to see my room. Bro, what are you doing? What did you do to the pill? Yeah, Jesse used to always have these segments in his vlogs where um, he would go into the hotel room and people would be humping the pillows. <laughs> Look at the way I just fling it. Can't wait to see my room. Bro, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Good times, man. I miss those vlogs. I miss traveling, bro. I want to go back to Miami after our two hype Miami trip, bro. I was like, man, I want to plan a proper Miami trip where I don't got to film. Maybe I'll vlog a little bit, but I don't got to film videos. I'm just going to relax at South Beach, go to Winwood, do some shopping. You feel me? Chill at the hotel, but got to wait. Got to wait a long time. Choose one. LeBron post spin, Joel post spin. Uh, well, you know, LeBron is LeBron, so... I'm gonna go with that for now. My beautiful dork twisted big shirt Jidel. <laughs> a lot of times you guys comment on my videos, I have like the most creative ideas or I'm the most original. Sometimes I think you guys over credit me for that, but you guys honestly are like the most creative people. The people on the subreddit, y'all are the most creative. Y'all are the most original. Y'all gotta give yourself some more credit than you give me, I swear. Famous birthdays. Really did them like that. Yeah. Famous birthdays, fix your stuff. I feel like every time I do one of these, I have to react to you guys just disrespecting the group. Moochie when they read two hypes, popular web searches. <sighs> yeah. My new favorite two hype character, Surfer Dude Zach. <laughs> this is my one thing I feel like as a YouTuber, I'm still so awkward about is like I'm doing a hide and seek video. And I, and you know, I'm expecting all of us to, you know, hide, sit by the door, wait for Jesse to hide and go. I'm not really ready for the mayhem that happens when the seekers are just bored waiting for the hider. And all of a sudden, Zach became a surfer dude yelling at Mopey. And I'm just like so in like the hide and seek mode. I can't even really soak it in at the moment. But Zach and Mopey were having the time of their lives waiting for Jesse to hide. Only true Jidel fans remember when he coached Jesse and Moochie in eighth grade with that 1 3 1 defense. Yeah, shout out to you, Big Shirt Jidel 60. Well, Big Shirt Jidel 60. <laughs> but remembering the 1 3 1 defense, that, you know, my friend Kyle helped me pioneer that. I think Syracuse was running it at the time. 
and it was working and uh our 131 i don't think we even coached it really properly we just had this kid named kevin uh who's super fast and athletic and so basically the way our, our 131 worked is he'd sit in the middle of the the three part of the zone and uh he was so fast that like Every time we rotated, Kevin could just fix any sort of like hole in the zone because he was just so fast. Like if the far corner would be open, like Kevin could get there in like two seconds. And uh, yeah, he made the whole defense work and uh, we should have won the championship. We lost by a point. It was really depressing. Make a Reddit video, play Warzone, two hype second channels. I've only done one Warzone video. Y'all loved it, thank you, but not a lot of people watched it, so I figure a lot of people don't want more Warzone. Shortly after I recorded that, my computer actually like completely malfunctioned, so I actually have like a brand new computer, kind of. I basically bought all new stuff except for a, a GPU and RAM and my heatsink, which then broke, and now I have like a stock heatsink, which is trash, so my computer actually can't play Warzone right now because the processor overheats, and I don't want to break my computer, but I can still record, you know, play PlayStation Xbox video, so that's good. Ah, yes. Normal shirts. Big shirt Jidel shirt. I'm gonna find it, guys. I swear to God, I'm gonna find it. Spam me on Twitter, you know, after this video. Remind me to find it, and I'll get it so I can wear it again. Day three of posting this picture of Joel Embiid until I get into a JDL subreddit video. Bro, imagine if Cleveland took Joel with the first pick and Joel and LeBron were teammates. That would be godly. And uh, that's it for this week, guys. I hope you enjoyed the subreddit reactions this week. I always enjoy making these videos. I love seeing what you guys put together. I love all the effort you guys put into all the memes, all the pictures, really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like below, comment you know, your thoughts on the memes, on uh, any changes you'd make to the subreddit series, if you wanna change anything up with it. You know, I'm always down to hear what you guys got constructive feedback on the videos. I like hearing constructive feedback. Hope you all have a great day. Woo!